Hello, hello, guys. Welcome back. Welcome back. How are you doing today? It's Monday. How do you feel today? Hi, teacher. I am great. Thank you. Very good. Very good. How was your weekend? My weekend was very busy. Oh, really? What did you do this weekend? Did you work? Well, in my case, I visited my, my father. Mm, okay, okay. That's nice. You had a good time with the family. Hello, Edma. Hello, yes. Nubia. How are you? Hi. Awesome, good awesome. Evening. Good evening, good evening. Welcome back. Hello, Norma. Hello, Blanca. Hello. Welcome, guys. Welcome. Hello, Yancy. Hello, Maria. Hello, Anna. Hello, Josia. Hello, George Alberto. Hello, Isaura. Good evening. Hello, Christina. Hello, Nelson. Hello, Hello Susanna. Hello, Fatima. Welcome, everybody. I hope that you all had a great weekend. I hope that you rested, that you studied, <laughs> and that you practiced your English. Did anybody practice the English on the weekend? Did you watch any movies in English or read a book in English or something like that? In my case, yes. What did you watch? What did you do? Listen and the music. Ah, listening to music in English. What kind of music do you listen to? Ochenta. 80s, nice, nice. I like the 80s. All right, welcome back, guys. We're going to go ahead and get started. Who can tell me what information do you remember from last week? What information do you remember from last week? week and uh hablamos de auxiliary did that is correct uh in what situation are we going to use the auxiliary did when are we going to use did for to express what The, uh, did use the question. That's right. Did is used yes. to ask a question, right? For example, let me let me give you some examples just to refresh. Um, did you go grocery shopping? this weekend everybody listen and repeat did you go grocery shopping this weekend did you go grocery shopping this weekend did you go running this weekend Repeat, did you go running this weekend? Did you go running this weekend? This weekend? Did you go out this weekend? Repeat, did you go out this weekend? Did you go out this weekend? Did you eat? Pupusas, pupusas last night. Did you eat Did you visit your family this weekend? Repeat. Did you, did you visit, visit family 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 family
to church this weekend? Repeat, did you go to church this weekend? Did you go to the movies this weekend? Yeah, teacher. Oh, really? What movie did you watch? The uh, Full Metal Alchemist on the Netflix. Oh, nice, nice. No, no, no. Okay. Did you did you go to the movies? Means fuiste mm. al cine. Uh -huh. Okay. The next one. Did you go to the beach this weekend? Repeat. Did you go to the Did you go to the beach this weekend? Okay. Did you watch any movies this weekend? Repeat. Did you watch any movies this weekend? Watch any movies this weekend? Did you watch any, watch any movies any this, movie weekend? this weekend? All right. Let me have one volunteer. Let me have one volunteer. one volunteer that wants to ask the questions. Do you prefer victim teacher? Ah, okay, Jose Luis. No, you're not teacher, victim. <laughs> Go ahead, Jose Luis, ask, okay. ask me the questions. Uh, and you? Yeah, you ask me the questions. Okay, did you go grocery shopping this week? Weekend, yes, I did. Okay, did you visit your family this week? Weekend. This weekend, uh, no, I didn't. This... No. No, I didn't. Uh, okay, did you go running this weekend? Yes, I did. I went to La Ciclovia on Constitution Boulevard. Uh, okay, mm -hmm. did you go to the movies? And no, I didn't. I didn't go to the movies. I I started working. I started to watch a movie. No, I don't work on the weekends. Uh, I started to watch a movie on TV, uh, but then I fell asleep. Oh, did you go to the beach this weekend? Yeah, no, I didn't. No, I didn't. Did you go watch any movie this weekend? I didn't go to the movies this weekend. Okay, your turn, teacher. All right. Uh, did you eat pupusas last night? Yes, I eat last eat last night. Do we say eat or ate? Eat, ate. Ate. Uh huh. The response yes, is I ate. Simple pass. Uh -huh. Okay, simple pass. All right, let me have two more volunteers. Uh, go ahead, select somebody, Jose Luis. Uh, Edwin, is he here, Edwin? Hi. All right, yes, Ed Edwin, go ahead. Edwin, okay. Uh, Edwin and another volunteer, one more volunteer. Somebody? Edwin uh, is going to ask the questions. I may teacher. Okay. okay. Edwin, ask. The, send the group or different questions? Oh, the same questions. The ones that I sent to the uh, WhatsApp chat. Okay. Mm -hmm. yeah. Go ahead. Ask the Do questions. Edwin. Shopping this weekend? No, uh, Jose Luis is going to ask the questions oh. and Edwin oh, is going to question. respond to the okay. question. Okay. Edwin responded to the question. Mm -hmm. Okay. Did you go grocery shopping this weekend? No, I didn't. Did you go running this weekend? Yes, I did. Okay. Did you go out this weekend? Yes, I did. I went to the church with my family. Okay, in this yeah. case, we're not gonna say I went to the church. 
You just say, I went to church. To church. I went to church. Okay, coach. I went to church. Yes. Did you go to the did you go to the movies? No, I didn't. Why? <laughs> Some drama. Did you watch any movie this weekend? I don't remember, but no, I didn't. And did you visit your family this week? Did you visit I... your family this week? No, I didn't. No. Okay. No. I finished teacher. Okay. Now go ahead and select somebody. Yeah. Edwin. Or all other. No, somebody different. Okay. Edwin select yeah. somebody and Jose Luis select somebody. Uh, Edma. Edma, yeah. ask the questions. <laughs> In my case, uh, okay. I don't know, Carlos. Carlos, respond to the questions. Yes. Ed, okay. Ed, Edma asked the questions. Carlos, respond to the question. Yes. Hi, yeah, Carlos. <laughs> ready? Did you yeah, go grocery ready. shopping this weekend? No, no. No. Did I, you I, go I, running this weekend? No, no, I don't go to Reading. Did you go out this weekend? Uh, yeah, I go to the museum. I go okay. to the museum. In the museum, I I do my social service. Uh, do we say I? Do you say I go or I went? Okay. I went. Uh -huh. Simple past. Uh -huh. Do you say I do my social service or I did my social service? I did. I did. Correct, correct. Because it's simple past. Correct, correct. Did you eat two pulses last night? Oh, no. I don't no. like <laughs> Did you visit your family you don't like this pupusas? week? Hmm. What? Qué raro. Why? They are the best. You are a Salvadorian, Carlos? Mm. <laughs> I, I am Salvadorian. <laughs> I, I, don't, I, I only like the, the, the pupas the, that is made in my home. Ah, oh, okay. Okay. Do you visit your family this weekend? Oh, no. I stay away from my family on the weekend, but I I went to my family house today. Okay. Did you go to church this weekend? No, no. 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 Did you no. go to the movies? No, I, I don't. I don't. No, I don't. No, I don't. No, I don't. Or no, I didn't. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Did you go out to the beach this weekend? No, no. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Did you watch any movies this weekend? No, I, I didn't. All right, now okay. change roles. Carlos is going to ask the questions and Edma is going to respond. Okay. Okay. What? Donde puedo ver las preguntas? In the chat? In the chat del Zoom y en el chat del WhatsApp. Okay. Well, well, do you go to the grocery? Yes, I shopping did. Shopping Yes. Sorry. Yes, I did. Did you go running this weekend? 
No, I didn't. You don't like running? I like running, but um, this um, last weekend, no, I didn't. Okay, nice. Did you go out this weekend? Uh, mm, uh, mm, I, I, no, I didn't. I stay home. Okay. Do you like to go out? Or you prefer to stay home? I prefer to stay home. Yeah. I do prefer, I do prefer to stay home. Okay. 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 Let's change. Go ahead. It must select somebody. Carlos select somebody. Okay. Let me okay. see. Um, is Susana Isabel? Susana Isabel, ask the question. Uh, Christina Karen. Okay. Karen. Christina Claribel, you will respond. La, the same that. Yes. yes, please. Did you go grocery shopping this weekend? <clears throat> Repeat, please. Did you go grocery shopping this weekend? Uh, yes, I did. Did you go running this weekend? Yes, I did. Did you go go out this weekend? Yes, I did. <laughs> did you eat pupusas last night? No, I didn't. <clears throat> no, I didn't. Did you? No, I didn't. Okay. Did you visit your family this weekend? No, I don't. I didn't know. Uh, no, I didn't know, or no, I didn't. No, I didn't. Okay. Okay. Did you go to church this weekend? Yes, I did. Did you go to the movies? No, I, I did. No, I did, or no, I didn't. No, I didn't. Did you go to the beach this weekend? <clears throat> no, I didn't. Okay. Did you watch any movies this weekend? No, I didn't. Excellent. Okay. We're going to go ahead and stop right there. Thank you. Uh, now, what we are going to do is we are going to go ahead and continue working on the platform. We are going to be looking at the next section, which is going to be section number three. In this section, participants will listen to a conversation between neighbors asking about places in the town. Pay attention to there is, there are, one, any, and some. En esta clase, escucharán una conversación entre vecinos preguntando sobre qué lugares hay en la ciudad. Ponga atención al uso de hay, un, algún, algunos. For example, si tú quieres decir, hay un parque cerca de mi casa. You say, there is a park near my house. Ese es el... There is. There is es como para cosas singulares. Um, tú dices, eh, hay un carro mal parqueado. There is a car badly parked. Okay, so el there is es para singular. Hay un McDonald's cerca de mi casa. There is a McDonald's 
McDonald's near my house. Okay. El there are es para plurales. Uh, tú dices, hay perros ladrando. There are dogs barking. There are dogs barking. Hay perros ladrando. Um, hay niños jugando. There are children playing. Right. Plural. Oh, hay bolsas de basura en la calle. There are trash bags in the street. Right. So el there are es plural. Is, yeah. mm -hmm. Any questions? No. Any, okay. Let's. I'm going to share with you the examples. I'm going to share with you the examples in the chat. Okay. Now, everybody, we're going to watch the video and then we will practice. Conversation. I'm your new neighbor. Soy tu nuevo vecino. Let's look. I'm your new neighbor. I'm your new neighbor. Everybody listen and repeat. I'm your new neighbor. I'm, I'm your new neighbor. I'm the new neighbor. Excellent. I'm your new neighbor. Share sound. Listen, please. Welcome, everybody, to Section 8. Can everybody What's hear? What's your neighborhood like? As we always do, we listen yes. to Okay. Yes, yes, ¿Qué quiere, yes. ¿Qué quiere decir, what's your neighborhood like? What does that mean? What's your neighborhood? Correcto. Es? Correcto. What's your neighborhood like is, ¿Cómo es tu vecindario? What's, what's your neighborhood like? What's your neighborhood like? Es Very como, noisy. ¿Cómo es tu vecindario? Very noisy. Okay. O quieres decir, ¿cómo es tu papá? ¿Cómo es tu mamá? What's your mom like? O ¿cómo es tu papá? What's your dad like? Very polite. Uh -huh. Hard working. Eh, quieres decir, por ejemplo, ¿cómo eres tú? What are you like? All right, everybody listen and repeat. What's your neighborhood like? What's your neighborhood like? What's your mom like? What's your mom like? What's your dad like? What's your dad like? What are you like? What are you like? All right, so these are just some examples. Let me go ahead and send them to you. Teacher, I have a question. Yes, what's your question? So neighborhood is vecindario. Neighbor Correct. is vecino. Correct. Neighborhood, okay. vecindario. Neighbor is vecino. Okay, thank you. Yes. So, we listen to a conversation in order to get ready for our topics, which will include places around town, location, and there is, there are. In this session, you will listen to a conversation between neighbors asking about places in town. Pay attention to there is, there are, one, any, and some. Excuse me, I'm your new neighbor, Jack. I just moved in. Oh, yes. I'm looking for a grocery store. Are there any around here? Yes, there are some on Pine Street. Oh, good. And is there a laundromat near here? Well, I think there's one across from the shopping center. Thank you. By the way, there's a barber shop in the shopping center, too. A barber <laughs> shop? <laughs> she told him, get a haircut. 
All right. Uh, does anybody have a question? A question uh, about this vocabulary? A question about uh, the meaning of the words? A question related to this topic? Anybody? Question, question? In my case, I don't have. Does anybody have a question uh, about the vocabulary, question about the pronunciation or the meaning of any of the words in the conversation? Uh, the meaning, laundry. Laundry. Laundromat. Laundromat. Uh -huh. Laundromat. Lavanderia. Laundromat. Uh -huh. In the United yes. States, it's it's very normal that people wash their clothes in a public uh, laundromat. It's very it's very normal. In El Salvador, I have never seen a laundromat. You have places where people wash the clothes for you. It's very expensive. But teacher, sure. in my in my in my downtown, there is a laundromat. Oh really? Yeah. Oh nice, nice. And do you do the machines have do you put quarters in the machines or what is the process? Repeat please. Um the machines that are in the public laundry mats do the machines do you put quarters in the machines or how yeah. do oh okay quarters quarters. quarters quarters like in the united states very nice cool all right uh let's listen and repeat listen and repeat i sent the conversation in the whatsapp chat excuse me i'm your new neighbor jack I just moved in. Oh, yes. I'm looking for a grocery store. Are there any around here? I'm looking for a grocery store. Are there any around here? Yes, um, there are yeah. some on Pine Street. Yes, yes there yes. are some um, on Pine um, Street. Oh, good. And is there a laundromat near here? Oh, oh. 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 And, and is there a laundromat, laundromat near here? Well, I think there's one across from the shopping center. Well, I think mean, there's one across from the shopping center. Thank you. Thank you. By the way. By the way. By the way. There's a barber shop in the shopping center too. There's there is a barber shop in the shopping center, too. A barber shop? A barber shop? A barber shop? <laughs> Como que le están tratando de decir, cortes el pelo, ¿verdad? <laughs> All right. Um, any questions about the vocabulary? Questions about the pronunciation? Or questions related to the topic? Okay, right now I'm going to take the attendance. When I call your name, I would like for you to please say present. When I call your name, please say present. Are you ready? I'm ready. ready. All, right. ready. all right, all right. Let's see. Alba Luz. Present. Present. Say is the six. Um, Ana Yamilet. Present teacher. All right. Blanca Guadalupe. 
Present teacher. Good. Carlos Ernesto. Present. All right. Cristina Claribel. Present teacher. Good. Edma Azalia. Present teacher. Okay. Edwin Alexander. Present teacher. All right. Efraín Emilio. Efraín Emilio. Absent. All right. In the chat coach. Oh, he's present. Okay. Uh, Fatima Elisa. Present teacher. Okay. Fatima Noemi. Present teacher. Okay. Uh, Herbert. Herbert Eliseo. Present teacher. Okay. Uh, Isaura Evelia. Present teacher. Okay. Josia Alexiomar. Present teacher, present. All right. George Alberto. Present teacher. Nice. George Enrique. George Enrique is absent. Jose Luis. I am here, teacher, over here. Jose Luis. I am here. Okay. Maria Elizabeth. Present teacher. Okay. Nelson Adan. Nelson Adan. Absent. In the chat. Oh, okay. Norma Elizabeth Callejas. Present. All right. Norma Elizabeth Lizano. Present, teacher. Okay. Present. Okay. Novia Cristina. Present. Oscar Alexander. Oscar Alexander is absent, okay? Sylvia Lisette. Present. Present. Susanna Isabel. Present. Nice. Yancy Melanie. Present. Jenny Carolina. Present teacher. Jocelyn Yvette. Present teacher. Okay. All right. Now what I want you to do is we're going to work in pairs and I want you to practice the conversation. Vamos a trabajar en parejas y vamos a practicar la conversación. Trate de practicarla las más veces que pueda. You're going to work together for five minutes. Five minutes. And I would like for you to practice the conversation as many times as possible. Practice the conversation as many times as possible. Ready? Let's go.
are there any rounds? Yes, there are some on finish stream. Oh, good. Wow. And is there a longer wow. need here? Where? I think there's one across from the shopping center. Thank you. Be they why there's a barber shop in the shopping center too. I barber shop. Jorge Alberto, ¿será que va a practicar? Ah, uh, hola, hola, compañero. Gracias, sí. Ok, si gusta empiezo, ¿y usted sí? Sí, por favor. Ok. Excuse me, I'm your new neighbor, Jack. I use more it in. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> I am looking for the grocery store. Are they any around here? Yes, there are some on Pine Street. Oh, good. And in, and in there uh, a laundromat near here. Well, I think there's one across from the shopping center. Thank you. By the way, there's a barber shop in the shopping center too. A barber shop? <laughs> Hoy comienzo. Hoy inicio. Uh -huh. okay. No sé me. si Fátima quiere, quiere ayudarle o siempre le ayudo yo. Fátima, si gusta, está bien. Sí, claro. But, excuse me. I'm your new neighbor, Jack. I just moved in. Oh, yes. I'm looking for a grocery store. Are there any around there? Yes, there are some on Pine Street. Oh, good. And is there a long there? Well, I think there's on a car from the shopping center. Thank you. Be the guy. By the way. Uh, by the way, there's a barbershop in the shopping center, too. A barbershop? <laughs> okay. Okay. Otra vez ustedes, si gustan. ¿Tienen duda en alguna, ¿tienen duda en alguna pronunciación? Si gustan, les puedo ayudar, solo dicen. Neighbor, es así. Sí, neighbor. Uh, por ejemplo, dice, excuse me. I'm your new neighbor, Jack. New neighbor. And just, I just moved in. Just. Moved in. I moved in. I just moved in. I just moved in. Oh, yes. I'm looking for a grocery store. Are there I'm any around here? Around here? Mm -hmm. Yes. They are, they are there are oh. some. There are some. There are some. There are some on Pine Street. Street. Uh -huh. Pine Street. Oh, good. Oh, good. Oh, good. Oh, yes. I am looking for a grocery store. Are there any around here? Yes. There are some on Pine Street. Oh, good. And um, is there a laundromat near here? Well, I think there's one across from the shopping center. Thank you. By the way, there's a barber shop in the shopping center too. A barber shop. By our right, to go. Sí. Excuse me, I am your neighbor, Jack. Is just moving in. Oh, yes. I'm looking for a grocery store. Are there any around here? Yes, there are some on Pine Street. Oh, good. And um, is there a laundromat near here? Well, I think there's one across from the shopping center. Thank you. 
By the way, there is a barber shop in the shopping center too. A barber shop. Vaya, si quiere, iniciamos otra vez. Inicia. Ah, ya nos va a sacar. All right, let me have two volunteers, Herbert and Nubia. Herbert, you're going to be Jack. Nubia, you're going to be Miss Day Jack. Okay, wait a minute. Okay. Excuse me, I'm your, your new neighbor. I'm Jack. Just moving in? Just moving in. Oh, yeah. I'm looking for a grocery store. Are there any around here? Yes, there are some. Uh, oh, good. And in this, and there a line roadmap near here? What? Thank you. Bye. A barber shop? I think that uh, probably Nubia has uh, problems with the microphone or the internet connection. All right. What we're going to do now, guys, is you are going to write a similar conversation here in the discussion forum. You are going to write a similar conversation here in the discussion forum. It can be asking questions about places in your neighborhood, whatever neighborhood that you live in. Um, or you can talk about another neighborhood if you don't want to talk about your neighborhood. And then when you finish, you're going to put it over here in the discussion box. Any questions? Any questions? No, sure. All right, you will have five minutes to prepare. Ready, let's go. Uh, I use move it. Move in. I just moved in. Justo me estoy mudando, verdad? O me acabo de mudar. Mm -hmm. o no sé cómo lo puede traducir ahí. Ajá. Oh, sí. 
Estoy buscando una tienda de alimentos. Podemos poner ahí como que estoy buscando un parque. Uh -huh. Sí, puede poner algo diferente. I am looking for a grocery store. I am. I am. I am looking. Looking. ¿Qué significa? Estoy buscando. I'm looking for. I'm looking for. Es una. Looking for es como un verbo frasal. Podría sí. ser, como sí. dijo eh, la compañera, dijo parque, ¿verdad? Sí, estoy buscando la iglesia, estoy buscando el parque. Ajá. Park. Uh -huh. I'm looking for a, ¿qué? A the, I'm looking for a office, office post, ¿sí? por la oficina postal o the post office. Ajá. I'm looking for the post office. Are there any around here? Hay alguna uh, en los alrededores de aquí? Uh -huh. Puede, podemos poner, oh yes, there is one to block for, from the apartment. Sí, hay una a dos cuadras del apartamento, no sé. ¿Cuál? Sí, sí. ¿Dónde? Ah, la contestación, que si hay una, un parque o un centro de correo, como puso, como puso. Ah, yes, o... o... Yes, there are some on... Hay cualquier calle. ¿Eso quiere decir usted? ¿Mm? Uh -huh, puede poner así. Hay... ¿Usted qué puso? ¿Que está buscando qué? ¿Un correo? ¿Un parque? Un parque. Y... Ah. Ajá, respuesta. Y... Oh, yes, there, yes. there, there, is, there, one there is block Ajá. from the apartment. There's, there's one. Ajá. There's one on downtown. Hay uno en el centro de la ciudad. Mm -hmm. Oh, good, dice. And is there a laundry manager? Ahí puede poner como drugstore. And is a drugstore near here? You, you, do you know this drugstore? What is this drugstore? Hay una farmacia cerca de aquí.
Um, yes. Yes, well. Yes, well. Pueden ser los dos, ¿verdad? Yeah. All right. Now, what we're going to do, guys, is uh, I know that everybody is not finished, but we have to move forward. What I would like for us to do is um, Nubia, who was, oh, no, Nubia's audio is bad. Uh, who was your partner, Jenny? Edwin Torres. All right, Edwin and uh, Jenny, let me hear your conversation, please. Okay. Excuse me, can you help me? Where is the market? Oh, the market is in front of the supermarket. Thank you. Um, I am looking for a church. Are they any around here? Yes, it's across from the main street. Oh, thank you. Are you new neighbor? Yes, I am a new neighbor. And you? Oh, uh, no, I'm not. Uh, thank you. Okay, thank you. You're Excellent. welcome. Bye. <laughs> Bye. All right, Bye. good. Good <laughs> job. Excellent work. Excellent work. Okay, guys, if you are not finished with this activity, uh, that's okay. That's going to be your homework if you are not finished. Uh, what we're going to do next is look at the next section. On the next section, we're going to be moving forward. Lesson objective. In this lesson, participants will learn about how to ask and answer questions with there is, there are, One, any, and some. En esta clase, participantes aprenderán cómo hacer y responder preguntas con hay, un, algún, y algunos. Listen, please. Go over prepositions of place, which will help us give directions. In this session, participants will learn how to ask and answer questions with there is, there are, one, any, and some. There is, there are, one, any, some. Is there a laundromat near here? Yes, there is. There's one across from the shopping center. 
No, there isn't. But there's one next to the library. Are there any grocery stores around here? Yes, there are. There are some nice stores on Pine Street. No, there aren't. But there are some on 3rd Avenue. No, there aren't any around here. Prepositions On Next to Near Close to Across from Opposite In front of In back of Behind Between On the corner of If you want to know if there is a place near you, we do it by saying Is there a near here? Of course, the answer will depend on if there is or not. You may answer yes there is or no there isn't. If your answer is yes there is, you may continue by saying yes there is. There is one next to the gas station. Prepositions of place. Let's go over the prepositions by looking at the map. The post office is on Main Street. The gas station is next to the public library. The shopping center is close or near the public library. The telephone booth is across from the gas station. The plaza is in front of the post office. The electronics store is behind or at the back of the post office. The plaza is between First National Bank and the grocery store. The gas station is on the corner of First Avenue. Make sure you practice and understand each preposition of place. With there is, there are, one, any, and some. There is, there are, one, any, some. Is there a laundromat near here? Yes, there is. There's one across from the shopping center. No, there isn't. But there's one next to the library. Are there any grocery stores around here? Yes, there are. There are some nice stores on Pine Street. No, there aren't. But there are some on 3rd Avenue. No, there aren't any around here. Prepositions On Next to Near Close to, across from, opposite, in front of, in back of, behind, between, on the corner of. If you want to know if there is a place near you, we do it by saying, is there a near here? Of course, the answer will depend on if there is or not. You may answer, yes, there is or no there isn't. If your answer is yes there is, you may continue by saying yes there is. There is one next to the gas station. Prepositions of place. Let's go over the prepositions by looking at the map. The post office is on Main Street. The gas station is next to the public library. The shopping center is close or near the public library. All right, guys, we're going to go ahead and stop right here. You can watch the video and do the other exercise, and we will see you tomorrow. Good night, guys. Bye, teacher. Bye. 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 Bye.